Good morning guys, welcome to Tuesday, and because it's Tuesday, we are at the sales barn this morning. I have a good, on good authority, Sophie has a feeling there's ponies here. <laughs> Is there ponies here? I don't know. Well, we're gonna find out if there's ponies here. But I don't know what we're gonna do if they are because it can no, be back there. I don't want them in the winter time, especially in the winter time. Too much work. Anyways, we're gonna check out if there's ponies. Where there's sheep, and there's big pigs, and there's cows, and there's more pigs. I don't see no horses. Lots and lots of sheep. Let's go down and see the goats. Go we'll see the goats? Alright, let's go see the goats. Oh, there's a lot of sheep today. Hey, how are you doing? How are you doing? Oh, we're going over here. See about the goats. See if there's any goats. Oh, you're... Oh, well, you're a friendly little baby, yeah. I think. You look like you're friendly. Oh, here's the goats. Here's the go oh look at these shaggy goats. Look at these shaggy goats, oh. Look at them. Look at these guys. This is the kind of goats we should get. Look at them. They're like Ruby. You're like Ruby. Ruby goats. That is interesting. Is that a goat? Yes. I must think. be a goat, but look at them. <laughs> they, look, they have nice curly fur. They must have to shave these ones. That's interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, these are my favorite goats now. <laughs> Only problem is I would never get one because I wouldn't know what to do with all the fur to shave it. Mm. So Sophie found a friend. Sophie found a friend. I like this one. It's pretty friendly. Mm -hmm. Yes, friendly goat. But you guys, you guys friendly? No? I'm afraid? This guy's friendly. So we got a new friend. He's got pretty pointy horns there though. Yeah. He can he, look how pointy his horns are. Wow. Alright, no horses, so I guess we're to luck. Maybe next week. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he's itchy. I like this one. Yeah, it's pretty friendly. I like those furry goats. Mm -hmm. The best. Sophie had this best idea. What are we doing to your mom? We're gonna find somebody who's got a goat. And somebody's taking it for us. Alright, let's see what happens. Bad news. What? Got something to tell you. What? We bought a shaggy goat. A shaggy oh, goat. So cute. <laughs> Frank! <laughs> no, no. Got it. Where is it? Clayton's getting this for us. Yeah. <laughs> they were so cute. They were so shaggy. They were cute goats too, weren't they? Did you put it in the video? Yeah. They were cute shaggy goats. <laughs> I would not buy one of those because they're too shaggy and it seems like you'd have to cut their hair or they'd be all matted or something. But it's like a ruby goat. Yeah. That's all I call it for now. In the comments below, if you know what goat it is, let me know. I'm gonna call it ruby goat for now. So. We went to the mall this afternoon. We spent the whole entire day at the mall shopping. I got one thing for Gabby. That's like basically all I have to buy now. I got something for Daisy. Yeah, Sophie's always buying stuff for Daisy. Well, I only have stuff for her stocking, so she... A present. She needs more, but I'll go back to see Sophie never stops buying for her a dog or her horse. Anyway, we have to draw the prize for the Cowgirl Up with green hoodie. You know that camo hoodie that I have and Sophie has one too? Uh, I gave my phone to Gabby. Gabby, did you find somebody? She's yeah. just gonna scroll through them all. I found some. All right, find some. Who'd you pick? I found some. Okay, who'd you find? Paige Davis 653. Paige Davis 653 is the winner. So uh, Paige Davis, send me a message or send Cowgirl Up With Green a message actually and say, hey, I'm Paige Davis. 
I am the winner of the hoodie. Thank you guys so much for, for trying and playing along. That was so fun. I love being able to give things away from companies. That is one of my favorite things to do. But Paige Davis, you are the winner. It was such a beautiful day outside. We should have stayed home. I really wanted to see how Chino's moving because we're going riding tomorrow. He's going riding tomorrow if everything goes well. Wow, look at all the hay we got. There's it's more. Christmas time, you guys. And more in there. Holy moly! So if he wants us to, to see... Chubby. She's getting, yeah, she's so chubby. It's actually so hard to manage the weight of four horses that are all different. It's so hard to manage the weight of horses that are all different sizes. So like, to keep, to keep Penny alive, we need to give enough hay and then Honey gets it. So tell them about the sheep that fell over today. We oh. did a we did a short video of a sheep that tried to escape. I'll put it in this video. That was its second time trying to escape. Trying to escape being at the sales barn and it just flopped backward. I felt so bad for it. It was okay. It was just like happy. It was day. okay. It just <laughs> I felt so bad for him. I don't have treats for you. Why are you licking your lips? She had an apple. Yeah. Such a good girl. Yeah, we love you. Tomorrow for sure though. Tomorrow we are down in the barn. We have so many things we want to do that we have to do and we're going to be there. It's warm tomorrow. Yeah, it was so warm today, huh? It was cold. It's cold. Honey does not get cold. Yeah, she's a baby. She's learning really well how to regulate I her. I check every day to see if she's cold. Yeah. She's not. She's I like know. post We put a blanket on her and she we listened to her. She says, get this blanket off me. I don't need it. And I believe her. Like, I, we are really learning to listen to our horses. That's what we've done mostly this year. Hello, handsome.